if I could just ask you, what have you got out of today? It was an awesome opportunity to come and uh, together with other colleagues to, to network. But what I'm finding, and I'm, I find this particularly gratifying from the point of view of being a board member of MGS and somebody who is part and parcel of putting the, the strategy together, how um, relevant the strategy actually is to, to colleagues in, in the sector. And how, just in that, the session this morning, how consistent the, the if you like, the, the issues were. Um, between the two groups who are hidden from each other. So that indicates that the, 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 the main issues that have been identified in the strategy uh, have been identified with reasonable accuracy. Yeah. <coughs> Thank you very much. Can you just the main thoughts from today? Uh, well, I think it's always very useful to, for everyone to get around the table and, and discuss some of the ideas it's facing. Uh, the sector. Uh, I mean, obviously, everyone has their own different concerns and issues with their various different areas that they're, they're involved in. But it's kind of good to hear from the small independent museums through to the bigger organisations that there is commonality, uh, and you know, hopefully, something can come of it that, that's a positive development for the whole of the whole of the sector. Thank you. Thank you. Just that's share with okay. me your main thoughts that came out of today. Well, um, just uh, I think quite a lot of work still to be done, but it's very useful um, hearing from the other people in my group um, and actually getting some of the cries, which is always quite good, <laughs> um, as put in. And, and I got a lot of ideas as to um, how to fill in my questionnaire and actually how to, to make it um, fit into the accreditation, which is also very good. Well, oh, thank you for doing this for me. Um, what are your main thoughts that have came out of today? Well, I think it's been interesting for me. I've, I'm kind of new to this area, so it's been interesting for me to meet people, to meet other people that are um, in the same in the same um, se sector, as it were, um, and to hear what, what they're doing and um, what, what their strategies are. Um, I think it's been really useful having a discussion about how the national strategy fits in with our current work and, and I think that's, that's the thing that, that struck me as being really useful. Thank you very much. That's 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 <laughs> Thank you for this. Um, could you share with me what has been the main thing that's come out of today for you? I think the process of taking the strategy and trying to align it to the strategic plans that individual museums and, and uh, trusts have it, it is key and it's been able to get that feedback in where we have looked at the overall strategic plan, used it to do a business plan and then reverting that back hopefully to influence the development plan of the national body. Thank you. Thanks for doing this. If you could just let me know what's the main thing that you've got out of today? Yeah, I suppose it's actually meeting other people and finding out that they share a lot of the same concerns and issues that um, we do. So that's partly comforting <laughs> and sometimes they have interesting solutions uh, or ways they're dealing with things and that's helpful. Thank you. That's it. <laughs> Thank you. What has been the main thing that you've got out of today? Well, as an organisation that doesn't yet have a museum but we have a collection, for me, it's been very interesting to learn about some of the strategic challenges that other organisations face in similar circumstances and, and a chance to input into the, the strategy where there are perhaps areas that we think we could give a bit of support for, mm. particularly on the leadership and the strategic overview that, that, um, that we need guidance and support on. Yeah. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs>